K-tape tension. As we have covered in earlier videos, we now know K-taping is a non-invasive and non-pharmacological method of treatment, the effects of which are constantly being debated and studied. However, there are very few studies that have tested different tensions of K-tape application. In aiming to examine the effects of these varying tensions on sensory and modulatory stimuli, pain reduction and performance enhancement. This has led to some researchers looking to compare the clinical effects of K-tape with and without tension. De Jesus et al carried out research to assess the effects of varied tensions of K-taping on the quadriceps strength and lower limb function and found that the different tensions of tape did not promote changes in the parameters assessed at any of the analysed time points. A further study carried out by Pinheiro et al found that the use of tape tension did not enhance treatment outcomes at any point in time when assessing K-tape effects on knee osteoarthritis. There does exist several studies that have reported beneficial effects after application, including reduced pain and increased physical function, and according to the originators of the technique, a certain amount of tension is required to generate these therapeutic effects. You will note that in the technique videos, the tape is applied for the most part without tension and that the muscle is often taken into a passive stretch. Ultimately, the degree of stretch or tension can be manipulated by you, the therapist, but this is done with your own clinical rationale taken into consideration and the consideration of such contraindications as restricting movement or compromising neurovascular bundles.